What's going on YouTube? My name is Diesel and today we are back in Scrap Mechanic. Uh, 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 boo. Alright. Fine, fine, fine. Let's go. Let's go ahead. Let's get out of this. Let's go ahead. We gotta put it back on the lift. Because we're silly. Because we're crazy. We're silly. How's everybody doing today? I have a creation for you again. Uh, it's okay. You know, it's not bad. It could be better. But you know what? I think it's pretty fancy, and I like it. Uh, I want to thank everyone for the support also on these videos. Scrap Mechanic is a dope game, and it is out for release for all of you right now uh, on Steam. Go go get after it. Get after it. And what is that in the distance? I had a request. Someone wanted me to make an RV, baby. But uh, I don't do none of those like little campers. I don't do none of the campers. I go, I go big. You know what I'm saying? I go big, and I, or I go home. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? You know what I mean, bro? All right, check it out. It's got a little sunroof too. I will explain that in a little bit. Um, it could look better. It could. It does look like a double decker bus. But you know what? In the world of scrap mechanic, I didn't really have a lot of time to do this. Uh, but. Uh, I think it turned out pretty cool. And there's some cool features, like, uh, how comes this doesn't have a window? Oh, I'm gonna show you. Oh, oh, I'm gonna show you. It's real simple, got a little grill piece right there. I basically started with the grill piece. I wanted that to be the centerpiece of this jong right here. We got some lights, camera action. Oh, it's one of them. I forgot to do something here quick. Thank you for reminding me, guys. Gals, people. Gotta put some lights in the back. How do y'all know if we ain't, how do you all know if we uh, are backing up? If there ain't no lights. What about a license plate? Let's put a license plate on this journal here. Let's do it. Let's do it. Construction zone. Can I get a caution wide load? No? Welcome. Do not enter. Warning to falling objects. You know, that's pretty on point. That's pretty on point. Ah, oh, but it doesn't even up. Uh, oh? Oh, hold on. Warning falling objects. Fantastic. All right, so let me show you some of the features. Uh, let's see here. Let's just get rid of some of the stuff so I don't have the flashing thing popping up on it all the time. Okay, okay, okay. All right. So of course we got the giant hubcaps, and by the way, they all have suspensions on them. Everyone's like, "Do something with suspensions, bro," and I'm like, "You got it, homie. I got you. I got you on this." So how do you enter into this John? How do you enter into this bad boy? Well, we have a switch right here. You hit that switch, door opens up all kinds of fancy, you jump on in, and then it closes all by its lonesome. And it's controlled by this controller right there. So it's just one switch to a controller to there, and it is on a timer. And then it just goes out 90, and then five seconds later, it goes back 90. It's that, it's that simple. It's really that simple. I have two, count them, two electrical motors uh, one because you can control the power a little bit better and it doesn't make all that noise, you know what I'm saying? None of that like a freaking uh, like a freaking lawnmower motor. But this one goes to the back two wheels and this one goes to the front two wheels to add its own separate power because this is quite the structure. Now why is this here? Oh check this out, by the way. Just in case you all want to play some checkers or something, you know what I mean? Let's just go ahead and attach it, because I, I mean, there we go. Now it's now it's attached to something. That way, in the the daytime, or when this thing is rolling, the table don't be wobbling. You know what I'm saying? So let's uh, we got the two chairs. So this can hold up to four people, uh, if not more. Uh, I know that there should be like a shower or something like here. Uh, I got a little boxes over here to represent beds or a place to just you know sit back and crash, relax and just get ill. But where can we go? Like whenever you go RVing, the only point of getting and buying an RV is for all the whatnots and the doodads and the such and such. And that's why I have another controller over here and then this little tab here. Because say we want to go to some like, uh, I don't know where the robots are, uh, I have not seen the survival mode yet, but if there's robots in here, we're going to try and capture some and make them battle. And uh, you got a tailgate for that. So you pop this bad boy out. Oh. Oh, and we're good to go, baby. Look at that. That is fancy. Now you get your grilling, get your grill on, put out your chairs, your lawn chairs and everything like that. Get your, your, your macaroni salad, and you can watch robots go to, uh, go to battle, and I will enjoy that. 
I will enjoy that very much, sir, yes. Now, how this is uh, put together in the controller section, in the controllers, uh, there are four, count them, four. Uh, let's see here. Let's get this. All right. So up here, we have one, and we have two. Oh, we're missing a spot there. Hello. Now we're not missing a spot. Now, now we're full. Uh, okay, so we have the one and the two. One, two, three, four. Bow, bow. All right, let's go there. All right, so one and two. So one and two in the controller. We put that out uh, 75 degrees, 75 degrees. All right, and then we have the two hinges at the end here, which are just uh, swivel joints. Uh, the swivel goes there. And then it extends. So I needed space to have at least two spaces from the inside for it to retract as well. And then that goes in and out at 105 degree angle, 105 degree angle. And I put a little delay on it so that way when it retracts and it extends, it all just doesn't fly out at the same time. So that it that retracts, then it retracts. Oh no! <laughs> what happened? What happened? I did the same thing over here. Oh, it's this little piece right there. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. Let's go now. Uh, uh. Listen, if it's got to work, it's got to work. Boom. All right. Now let's see here. Uh. Oh, that is fancy. Because, I mean, really, in, uh, who cares if we have a little hole in the wall? In the hole in the ceiling. It fits. If it fits, I sit. So, let's do it again. Retracts. Very good. Very good indeed. And then, bang. Fantastic. I, I mean, I, I really outdid myself. Now, as far as the driving is concerned, uh, it drives like a bus. It really does. <laughs> and it got that electrical, electrical motor because not only are we thinking locally, we're thinking globally. It's environmentally safe. For all the peoples. Uh, now, of course, I only have the engines on five. So, this isn't something you're going to be going up mountains with. Let's just put it that way. But, for long road trips, you can go ahead and you can grab all of your foods and your peoples. And you can gather yourself a good time tailgating wherever you got to go. Let's see how fast we can, let's see how fast we can crank this. Now, the reason why I have this ceiling here, uh, this little sunroof, is one, because whenever you put a roof like directly over top this thing has to have like a 10 block clearance in order for you to be able to get out and not glitch and glitch through the thing when you get out of your seats so I decided to just make a sunroof and just be happy about it there's no rain there's no rain in here it's all beautiful sunshine and rainbows lollipops uh, let's see here let's crank up let's crank it crank it crank it up baby oh you button hooked me didn't know you were going to button hook me. All right, so here. Now let's see the power. Oh, now we're moving. Now we're grooving. It's a little much. It's a little, little too much. Let's go ahead. Let's go. This is as far as I can zoom out. Woo! Whoa! I'll tell you what. It hauls. Whoa! Whoa! Now, I don't know what the survival world is going to look like. I also don't know whether or not they're planning ever to have, uh, like, a terrain editor. Because if you are if you have a game that's all about cars and vehicles and flying machines, you got to be able to not have bumps in the road and create roads, you know? You can't have all this open field, but then there's all these little bumps here. I'll tell you what, that suspension really kicks it. I like it. It's good. It's very good. Very good indeed. I'll tell you what, it moves, it works, it's got all the functionality of an RV, of a bus, oh god, oh god, hello, oh god, yes, oh, ho, 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 whoa, whoa, wee, whoa, whoa, and we're ready to lock and load, save your soul, rocking and rolling, we're gonna be going and partying big time with this bad boy, nice, nice, let's park it right next to the Ford, F to the diesel F-150, Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Let's press you. Let's retract you. And now, where is the potato salad? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now, of course, I could have done a little bit of, a little bit better. A little bit, many much more. Many much more better uh, of a sign, if you could. 
probably put some double D's in there. Because, I mean, who doesn't like double D's? You know what I'm saying, bro? You know what I mean? No, uh, let's see. Uh, but, yeah. So, that's it, folks. That's, uh, that's my little area. That's my little RV. A little RV slash bus contraption. It's a good time. And this goes right down the center, too, so we could maybe accessorize. I could have I could have uh, decorated this a little bit better, but I was really just focusing on what I had in mind. I was like, I want this, and then I also want the door as well, and I hope you enjoy this episode. If you enjoy this episode, go ahead, hit like. It helps my channel out ever so much more than you know. Ooh, hey. Hello there. Where are those blocks at? Hmm. I'm just going to sit here and lounge on these boxes. Heck yeah. Ah. Uh. Oh, oh yeah. So folks, if you enjoyed this episode, go ahead, hit like. It helps my channel out ever so much more than you know. And if you go ahead and hit subscribe, there are new videos coming out every single day, every single week. Folks, have a great day, afternoon, evening, good night. Peace out, like, shout y'all, and I will check you out right here again in Scrap Mechanic next time. Oh, oh yeah.